Satan and what are the odds? If there's lightning in the area, it's best not to ask that question. Take cover instead. I'm about to show you an example of nature's fury that's best told by sound and not by words. Just my heart dropped because I said, I hope it's not my the person I know. Gloria Colocho gets emotional when she speaks of her friend, 51-year-old Antonia Mendoza, who was killed Wednesday morning after being struck by lightning while walking her dogs in Pico Rivera. Mendoza died with her puppies. When the deputies arrived, they did find a female who was lying on the ground, along with uh, two dogs that were with her that appeared to be deceased as well. These images show Mendoza in happier times. We see her beloved puppies, Chubby and Luna. Fox 11 obtained this nest video showing Mendoza leaving for her daily walk with her precious pets. These are likely the final images of them alive. That she was a sweet lady. She was very responsible. There were ominous warnings of a dangerous storm moving into this area. People were advised to stay inside Wednesday morning, but nothing would keep Mendoza from walking her dogs. How violent was the storm? Fox 11 obtained this exclusive video of the very moment the powerful lightning struck, eight seconds of sheer terror. It sounds like a war zone, but it was Pico Rivera. Listen to it again. The thunder sounds like a bomb. Vibrations so strong, they set off car alarms. The asphalt seared by the strike. Wednesday evening, Mendoza's car still parked at the entrance to the riverbed hiking trail, her Bible and rosary visible in the car. Her friend and landlady said Antonia Mendoza was trying to save up a nest egg to visit her daughter. When the landlady heard the victim was a woman walking two dogs, she had a terrible feeling Antonia was the victim. And she has her dog's uh, stuff in the car and her towels for the dogs, and, and that's why I just knew that it's her. Mendoza worked at a house as a housekeeper in a nearby motel. Sadly, her life ended today with two of her most trusted companions. Laura Diaz reporting live. Now back to the studio.